Well, lawmakers scored a win for college athletes looking to make money off the use of their name and their image and their likeness this afternoon. That's right. Senate Bill 646 cleared its first of three committees with unanimous support. Capitol reporter Forrest Saunders is tracking this bill and Forrest, the Senate and House versions are both making progress. That's absolutely right, Ava. We saw just last week the House Companion Bill moved out of its second committee. That means it has one left now before it reaches the chamber floor. Now, you might remember these bills are a priority for Governor Ron DeSantis this session. They were drafted as California is set to allow college athletes to have agents and endorsement deals starting in 2023. Critics do worry this legislation is going to wipe out the distinctions between college and professional athletics. The Senate bill sponsor, however, says that her policy is still a work in progress. She says it might morph in the future to incorporate things like a morality clause, which would keep businesses like casinos or alcohol makers from dealing with players. Is this the right, you know, do we have everything correct in the bill yet? I don't know, maybe not, but at least we're starting the discussion and we can come to a conclusion and, and, a, and hopefully a, a pretty good product by the end of session. The NCAA has long opposed the practice of allowing college athletes payment. Supporters of this bill believe passage will motivate the group to change. And the NCAA Board of Governors is already considering that rule change. But at last check, they are still reviewing it. That's the latest out here in front of the Capitol. I'll send it back to the desk. Thank you, Forrest. Well, 